This is how to start a casual table on BBO and ensure that if any of your friends who are playing with you lose connection to BBO, they can return without their seat having been taken by someone else. So we start by clicking on casual. And then we could click on start a table, but I'm going to click on all private, all public and private clubs because a lot of my followers on YouTube play in the ACOL Players Club so I'm going to set a table up in the ACOL Players Club third one down on the list that brings me a list of tables there are two tables waiting for players but I'm not interested in those because I'm going to start my own table with my own four players and here is the crucial thing you must move this slider across that says permission required to play and you'll notice it's added a lock to each of the seats i'll turn it off again you'll see the lock disappears turn it on and there the lock appears and that means that no one can play without my permission now i shall put my name in in the south seat and I will start the table and having started the table there's obviously no one there because I haven't invited anyone yet but let's just assume that I've been on the phone to my friends to say the table starting now come and join me and when one of my friends attempts to sit in the west seat I get a permission request which I accept and now he's sitting in the west seat now his partner asks if they can sit in the east seat and I accept them but CYRD who wants to sit in the north seat is going to get a no as is the person asking to sit in the east seat so there's just one seat left to fill and that's my partner and I'm going to actually invite him seeing as he hasn't applied to play so I'm going to reserve that seat for my partner and I'm going to click OK and it says at the bottom of the screen that he's not logged in or not available but at the same time it also tells me that I've reserved the seat for him so let's go over to his computer and see what he's going to see when he logs in. And here he is logged in, but he's not in casual. So he clicks on casual. And as soon as he joins the casual server, he gets an invitation to join my table. A seat is reserved for you. Take you there. And he says yes. And now we can see the table from his point of view. He's sitting north, and Betty is east, Morris is west, and his partner, Adam, is south. And if we look at that table again from the perspective of me, Adam 13, you see I'm sitting south, Morris is west, Betty is east, and my partner, Adam, is north. And it's his turn to bid. And he bids a heart. Betty passes. And I bid two diamonds. Morris uh, also passes. And it's back to my partner who unfortunately seems to have lost connection and the beauty of having locked the seats is that no one else comes along so let's now look at the situation from his perspective he's lost connection he re-signs in he goes back to casual and he clicks on his friends and hopefully he's got me saved as a friend when he clicks on my name he can 
sit on this asked to sit at the seat and it's waiting for permission and if we look at my screen I give him permission and he's back in his seat so by reserving the seats by saying that uh, permission is required to play then we make sure that if our friends lose connection they can always get back to the table by the method I've shown you here